Our trip to Rally of the Heartland started off with a bit of a bang with a tyre blowing out, which we quickly replaced. But it was soon a light on the dashboard that'd be of some concern. The alternator looked like it was done. So what's going on, Brad? Character building. Rallying is all about the uh, effort of getting there, which then generates the reward. And there we have it, one dead alternator. Ah. Oh, it's so on. The alternator sits next to the turbo, so it's a bit on okay. the hot side. Righto, good work. We go. We're in Wagga, thanks to Kevin Robin from Wagga Glass, who put in touch with the local guys here. And uh, it's about four o'clock for our first afternoon. We need some electrics to get across the high plane. We've still got <laughs> six or eight hours to get the borough. But we'll be right, we'll get it fixed. We've got a uh, very, very sick alternator. With the alternator all repaired and we're back on the road again, we soon pulled into Mildura where old mate said to us that our trailer was on fire, so we thought we'd better stop. It soon became evident that the wheel bearing was stuffed, so we had to take it off and do some more quick repairs. Once we got the hub out on the bench, it was pretty stuffed. In fact, there was no way we were gonna be able to fix that, so it was off to buy some new parts, which was pretty easy because there was a store full of trailer spares. So we finally made it to the Rally of the Heartland, and Brett, well, was he surprised? I'm not surprised, but I think it's a positive omen because all the bad stuff has happened before the rally, which means, based on the feedback of Adrian or Callister, is if you have a shit tra travel trip to a rally, you're guaranteed to have a good rally. So I think that's good. MRT, more repairs to the rally. 